Oh no, I'm a cripple. Shit. Why is the music so loud? Um, now this is one of the most universally... Here is a real switch for this series. This is one of the most universally reviled parts of the game. Everybody hated it. Um, you can see that the... I didn't uh, hate it. You could, <laughs> you could see that uh, the collectors are attacking the ship. Nobody liked this suddenly being pulled out of Shepard's body and switching from Shepard's viewpoint to suddenly playing Joker. Um, but I actually like this part of the game. The problem yeah, I, like I had with it, the problem I had with it was I heard you got to play Joker um, from somebody else. And I thought that meant that we got to fly the ship. And I got really excited because the Yo, idea of fly, you get, flying the ship was awesome. But no, you get to walk around as a cripple. You got really excited because you thought you were going to play Mark Hamill's Joker. Right, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Riddle me this, um, Batman. <laughs> one thing that I like what? about this sequence... <laughs> God damn it! Continue, Shane. What the One thing I like about this sequence is that... Um, it's common sense based. What I was really afraid when this sequence started was that it would either be you were invulnerable and you could just stand there like an idiot and you'd be in and you could just didn't have to worry about anything. You were just destined to succeed or that it would be this awful annoying trial and error thing. But it is um, common sense. There's one part where you have to pause. Or, you know, if you just keep, if you see some bad guys ahead of you, and if you blunder forward, you'll charge into them and die. And there's other parts where you have to hurry. And if you just use your head, you'll get through it. And I kind of like that. This does sound like something from one of Something Awful's troll video game reviews, though. <laughs> Patch section in which you play as Joker, wandering around on your crippled legs and trying not to attract the attention of enemies. Also, the True, chemistry I, between Joker and Edie is pretty awesome. Yes, it is better than the than the chemistry between Commander Shepard and any other character in the game. What? Shepard and yes. Garrus for life. Okay, Garrus and oh, anybody lie. else is better. Oh, Shepard has no care. Engineering is clear of hostiles. Proceed immediately to minimize chances you know, of detection. In the first game, I didn't realize this until recently, but didn't... Wasn't Joker only, like, crippled in the legs and not in his arms and everywhere else? Uh, he had brittle bone everywhere, it was Hostiles just his returned. legs have probably been broken more than everything else. Because, you know, their legs. How do I re... where's the button? Uh, you're going the wrong way. Um... Oh, well, I'm dead now. So that's what happens when Joker fucks up. Oh, you didn't win. That proves that Josh has no common sense. Oh, <laughs> I went to the console. Uh. See, I guess I was overestimating how brittle Joker's legs were, because earlier, like in the part where he went oh, over come and, like, on. Went to the ladder, I started cracking up. <laughs> like, well, yeah. I'm screwed, huh? <laughs> you know, I actually liked that going on the ladder. That ladder just like, <gasps> oh, that is so dangerous. Like, I kind of really felt like Joker. Like, this is that's a dangerous thing for him to be doing. One little slip with his weak hands, and he's a goner. He's just gonna go right to the bottom and shatter. <laughs> so they're stalling to save Joker from. And I love Joker's commentary as he's running around cursing and saying <laughs> funny things. It's like, can we play Joker in Mass Effect 3 and just Joker? 
we'd like throw Shepard off a cliff or something. Yep, yeah, sounds good. You know what? You shouldn't throw Shepard off a cliff. You should throw Shepard out of orbit onto the surface of a planet. That would definitely kill him. <laughs> yeah, I'd do it for Absolutely. sure. And nobody would be able to put him back together. What the shit? These little well, things. You know, there, Joker. If this was happening to me and I was on the ship, I would be saying the same shit that he is. I would just be saying shit, shit, shit <laughs> over and over again. And I love his dialogue. It's very funny. I have to the uh, system. the other problem I have with this sequence, aside from the, uh, the completely uh, idiotic, where did Shepard and everybody go, is, uh, where are the, uh, the swarm? Right. Yeah, why didn't the swarms come in and freeze everybody? Good luck. Maybe they didn't need them. I mean, maybe, like... Morton had They're some in like, ship. kind they of immunity on the ship installed or something. I don't know. The whole point of the bees is to um, is to make people keep them from running away. But if you're in a ship, there's nowhere to run. In space, no one can hear you scream. Hostiles are present in oh, yeah. No one can hear you scream, bees. Thank you for doing that for me, Shane. That is the coolest. I really oh, no. wanted to, and, uh, but I can't. I know the game, you, you as far as suspense throat. is that shadow crawling across the wall. I know, and that shadow that and shadow was what I think made me like this sequence. The fact that if you I actually replayed it again and charged up those stairs, and Activate yes, you will die if you're an idiot and, and charge up those stairs instead of pausing. What? What about the crew? <laughs> they are gone, Jeff. I actually went halfway up the stairs and watched them walk by and then I went up. And you, yeah. you can still be safe, but it's kind of cool to watch them. I have control. Why does the core have to, like, do that? Yeah, I mean, the I like this scene, but the justifications for it are very weak. And the fact that our main characters were all poofed away um, right. is very bad. It's like, do we overload the core to the point where the inertial dampeners don't work every time we go to FTL? And I guess we should count ourselves lucky that they didn't break something on Joker. Yeah, seriously. Yeah. Message away. Are you That's a metal floor that? he's on. No. Send a message to Shepard's shuttle. Ask him... Where the hell are you? And are you doing anything <laughs> related to the plot? I'm just asking. I was wondering if you were going to be in your own game, you know. Please tell me we're going to cut to the elusive man's back. Because that would really put a cap on this mission. No. Yes. <laughs> that would be awesome, but no. Everyone? You lost everyone and damn near lost the ship too? Oh look, Miranda's, Miranda's here to be a bitch. It's not his fault, Miranda. None of us caught him. I'm glad that she didn't get kicked off the shuttle in some kind of terrible accident. Was even more sophisticated than yeah, the black what the hell, Miranda? I was given. I heard it was a rough Miranda, what the yeah, fuck? She's yelling at him. Uh, we're the ones that left, and we're the ones with the guns. Yeah, fucking yeah, Joker, you loser. Yeah, he saves the day while we were out getting takeout. The IFF is Why the fuck did I just pick the option that was, we have to get the crew back? Don't even get me started about unshackling a damned AI. Well, what can I do against collectors? Break my arm at them? Edie cleared the ship. She's alright. I assure you, I am still bound by protocols in my programming. Even if I were not... Okay, that's it. Miranda gets court-martialed and then spaced in that order. Yeah. I know. <laughs> Actually, any order. I don't really Wait, care. Can we space her and then court-martial her? But, like, bring her corpse to the court-martial? And you can't even rein her in when she's being so bitchy and unreasonable to the guy who just saved the damn ship. When the rest of us were doing nothing. Where's the punch up? Where's the punch up? <laughs> Renegade interrupt. If I were Shepard, I would punch her in the face at that moment. I'm a fan of the nostril punch for her. 
Us dying doesn't do them any good. Yeah, Jacob. good call. We'll it would call. improve her face yeah, at least. No Don't punch her in that everywhere. jaw, you'll shatter your hand. Yeah, but we have like cyborg hands. What the get down. Okay, there is one thing we have to do before uh Well, aside from Rutska and singing. One thing we have to Hey Hey Nobody's standing here anymore. None of those characters that have names that I won't mention. Yay. We have to go talk to Tali and get the shield upgrade for the ship. Otherwise, we have any human chambers. I don't she want to was talk my about favorite it. character. Sorry, I, I really like. You remember that one conversation we had with her when she told us we had a message? That was great. Oh my god. Thank you. The whole trial was insulting. Uh, Tali, I think we've got bigger mind. priorities right here. <laughs> what you deserve. But my father would be honored. I see. I is there a renegade interrupt that would let you lick so her her helmet and leave a big smear on it, <laughs> just to grief her? Shepherd, what can or fog it up and then make a little happy face where her face should be. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> or just draw a happy face on her with a dry erase. Yeah. Yeah. With a sharpie. Just... While she's trying to talk to you, oh my god. <laughs> One day she passes out drunk and you just draw, like, stuff all over her face. <laughs> over her helmet. Alright, that's it. Let's go kill some collectors. Or all of the collectors. Because that's what we needed to do. That was the whole way you stopped the collectors. Is we just needed to get to the through the door to their base so that we could go in and shoot them. Instead of sticky, <laughs> setting up a sticky trap around the fucking portal so when they come through you just fucking kaboom them. Instead of going to the reefer and get reaper and the reefer. Reefer. Oh <laughs> the great barrier reefer. Instead of getting the reaper and the IFF, what we should have done is just hired one demo man. Yes. Put him in a spacesuit <laughs> and put him to work. Kaboo! Um, they don't start shake up for 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 to refine demo demo band demo demo band demo band. Oh my God! Why rots? Because <laughs> I like. All mine. right, let's do it. Let's finish this game. We're gonna plant mines around finish the Omega him. Four relay, or tow it into a sun. Right? That's what's gonna happen. That's a good idea. Please confirm destination, Shepard. I mean, really, why don't they just do that? If there's collectors coming through the Omega-4 relay, we know that not every relay can reach every other relay, so we can assume that that's the only relay they can exit, right? So why don't we just mine it? The collectors are about to find out what I mean, that, that's the it? easy solution. Yeah, you you mine, mine it, it? as in put mines around it. Oh, uh, I imagine Minecraft, like with a yeah. diamond yeah. pig. That would. I was that thinking might about too. the resources I'd get our, out of it. Oh my god! Are thirty-five million-year-old mass relays stronger than diamond picks? 